Hey everyone, it's Ellie Marie and I am back with another King Daniel video. So first of all, happy third anniversary Danity. Second of all, congratulations to Daniel because he won several awards last weekend and including Danity. You guys are amazing. Thirdly, I know Daniel recently had a V-Live. I kind of missed it. I have to go back and I have to watch it. And fourth, he released the dance practice video for his performance that he did in his concert for his songs Don't Tell and Wait. And in my recap slash review concert video that I uploaded for Daniel's concert, I mentioned how much I absolutely loved his performance for Don't Tell and Waves and that transition was perfection. And I really wished everyone could see that performance along with Antidote and Paranoia and just his entire concert. But anyway, with the fact that they released the dance practice video for that performance, ah, it's like a gift to Danity. I am so so excited to watch it and I really want a lot more people to watch at least the dance practice video for Don't Tell and Waves. Of course I haven't seen the dance practice video yet but his performance was amazing and I'm just I'm so happy that they released this. So with all that being said let's watch this dance practice video. I love how he's standing there and then the dancers are in the side. I wonder, is the camera gonna get closer? Probably not. I love that part when he goes to the side and then the other side. Cause the thing is in the music video we only see a little bit of the choreography. I love that part. I love it. I love his choreography in the chorus. The thing is, this song and waves, they're just so sexy. And I love it. I love that part. And I love how the dancers like spread out like that. My favorite part. And then the guys and the girls, I love this part. The guys are on one side, and I love the choreography that they do, and then the girls, and then they go to uh, chef's kiss, chef's kiss. And then the partner work, and, it, and then Daniel's just like standing by himself, but it is just, oh, so good. Honestly, I wish everyone would see this performance. Oh, it was so good. I love it. <laughs> that transition, I love it. How it was just like fades in. <laughs> this is one of my favorite songs, you all. <laughs> I love it. And I love how the dancers are just like, gone. And then they just go straight to the chorus. I love how the dancers are like covering the stage and it's just so good. So Honestly, I wish he would have performed Waves a lot more. Like when the song was originally released, like, it's, oh man. Okay, I need to calm down. Listen, I love these songs so much, especially Waves. It's like one of my top favorite songs. It's a jam. And the fact that he performed both of these songs and that transition is just so smooth. I realize I sometimes get a little too excited for choreographies, but I can't help it. Choreographies really do help bring a song to life and I absolutely love it. So I will never shut up about choreography, especially when it's really good. Okay, so you guys saw how amazing this choreography is. So imagine when he performed it in his concert, you all, when I tell you it was amazing, 
It's seriously one of my favorite performances of the night, plus Antidote and Paranoia and honestly, A Thousand Times, just basically all his songs. It was amazing. Don't Tell and Waves are definitely kind of similar songs. They're both super sexy. Once again, I really wish a lot more people could see this performance. But anyway, this dance practice was such a treat. Thank you to everyone involved in Daniel's concert. It was amazing. I know I keep saying it, but it's true. And yeah, so with all that being said, once again, I'm Ellie Marie. If you're new around here, hi, welcome. You can feel free to subscribe. Uh, I hope you all have a wonderful day and I will talk to you all in the next video. Bye.